I started extra traveling at six years old. I was extra traveling at six. I was in a, I had, I had demonic attacks snatch me out of my body. They snatched me to the realm, snatch me out of my body. And I was, I got attacked. You know, I had to figure out what was going on. You know, I had to. So they, they've been there. They've been watching me. And this is why, because this day was coming. You know what I'm saying? So I got to the point where I started meditating and stuff. But I, and I, and like I said, it's, it's, the most I speak to you in your environment. The answer is going to show you. It's all going to be in your environment. It might be little things. It might be a fucking bug. Mm -hmm. A ladybug might crawl across your foot. But you gotta pay attention to it. But you, you gotta get the fucking message. And right. Why it's happening? Where you at? Where I'm in Detroit right now. Like you know, see what I'm saying? Where you are? Where you? Every fucking thing, bro, in your fucking life matters. Every little thing in your life matters. My name is Brother Dooley, aka the Bean Town Ghetto Chum. You know what I mean? Um, rap A man. It's, 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 it's jungle medicine, you know what I mean? We uh, use rap A, man, to get all the mucus and the phlegm out the system. The late Dr. Sebi, for those who don't know him, he cured AIDS, uh, cancer, diabetes, all kinds of stuff. And he told our people, the too much mucus in the body and too uh, overly acidic body is uh, uh, home for disease to manifest. So we tell people to get all that mucus out. And also, I'm a Qi Kong practitioner, so you want to bring more Qi into your body, you got to have that, that flow going with your breathing, so you got to get all that mucus out. Rape also helps stimulate the third eye, the pineal gland, so you could start decalcifying that pineal gland because, you know, they're hitting us with all the fluoride, water, and all the rest, you know what I mean? Also, Rape helps open up the meridian channels if you have any block um, channels in your body. Also, in the jungle, we say panema. If anyone deals with panema, panema is bad juju, bad energy, dark energy. It breaks uh, uh, hexes, curses, dark uh, daggers that people are throwing at you from afar. Um, Papi does a lot of things. It, it uh, helps get the parasites out of the body. It also helps um, individuals if they're dealing with uh, anxiety. What did Kalinde say? <laughs> Grow your own. The mushroom got one instruction on the stock. Grow. Keep growing. If the mushroom stop growing and it stops sporulating, all together now on three, trouble. One, two, three. Trouble. One more time on three. One, two, three. Trouble. Oh. If the mushroom say, I ain't, I just ain't, I ain't, ain't, ain't going to spoilate no more, Dakota. Now I'm good. Now I'm finished. What's that nice light that you have upstairs? Lucia. The Lucia light. The technology for the Lucia light comes out of the mushroom. Anybody done ayahuasca before? Technology and the alchemy to blend the ayahuasca comes out of the mushrooms. Astrology comes out of the mushrooms. The technology to build pyramids and make them float and move them around and then set them down weightless and then they get really heavy came out of the mushroom. The tantric sciences came out of the mushroom. In the spirit of my brother Kalinde Oronde Yee, and in the spirit of his family who loves him, his family, his, his extended family, all of you who are now extended family, I give praises to the Almighty. Mojuba Olodumare, Mojuba Ashe, Mojuba Aye, Mojuba Ashe, Mojuba Ara, Mojuba Ashe, Mojuba Ibaurisha, Mojuba Ashe, Mojuba. Thank you. 
I'm not saying what isn't or is is right. is. You know what I mean? Right. I'm saying this is cycle not reporting back. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm okay. saying we've all said the same thing on a gram or two because the shit we see, of course, we like, nah, trust me, bro. I seen. But it's like saying that about the gram or two to a motherfucker who like, man, I can do that through meditation. You going, nah, not really. Cause I meditate. Meditate <laughs> on a few grams. And I'm going. Take enough grams to where you can't meditate. <laughs> right, you can't even you sit up. Got you can't control shit. You got grand time. You go, oh, am I breathing? My, what the fuck is breathing? What are lungs? What, yeah. what, what the fuck am I? What is what? Like, that's breaking the veil to where, like Bob was saying, until you feel like you did too much, you ain't good enough. Man, I feel like y'all giving me some real game. This is even better than the shit in there right now. Like, yeah. I don't think that has ever done enough to where they felt like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have did that many. Yeah. No, nah, you I feel like, like damn, three, is, but you ain't never been like, oh shit, no, I hey, did too many. No, That's hey. the point where, what they call the ego death, I don't like that term, uh -huh. but it's like, because it kills off the self, like, yeah. Oh shit! But I mean, what do you do when you reach that spot, though? That's then you give I, up. Right, that's all you can do. That's man, you just like hands that's up. That's hands that. up. what you're looking for. Because once there's no control right. and there's no nothing, it's like, all right, what you got? Fuck it, I, I can't do shit. Which it's like trying to fight a motherfucker. You keep and your motherfucker holding your head. You, man, you still you know, you know, you know, just stop. You're like, all right, what? It was in the book. Oh, I have to in the book. Detroit Conference, Detroit Psychedelic Conference. Big up my homie, Baba Kalindi, all day, every day. Did you know that Lord Shiva listened to high tech?